This is a general purpose cellular automata with little square representing uh, cells. So when I run it, instruction come from the host from the four corners. Here it's a sequence of three instruction that you also see here. The first instruction uh, select um, uh, the blob which identifier uh, B which you see here B okay this is the thing within the green membrane the second so if I print uh, the select register it becomes selected after the instruction then the next instruction set the region uh, where selected is true and then the third instruction D trigger a, di a division so when it triggers a division um, the whole uh, the whole region becomes an independent thread of computation from the rest which means signals which will subsequently be emitted within the region will bounce will bounce on the region those signals carry a micro instruction we need four micro instruction to perform division so the first um, micro instruction uh, is emitted uh, right um, when the particle in the center is in the center it divides it creates um, it creates a hole in this um, in this uh, green uh, material which is a hole a wall and uh, those two will trigger the second microcycle at different step because this one is believes it's already in the middle but this one uh, not it takes more time and as soon as the second one uh, has also sent its uh, micro instruction. It triggers um, uh, um, uh, <clears throat> the membrane to be sucked by the green wall which remains, and which is like a median between those two points so it uh, strangles and when we reach this specific configuration with uh, there is a final cut can be performed and, and the, the two cells separate and the signal f the, f the last signal which uh, says that division is finished is uh, sound and you see now it goes from blue to back to green what was before that specifies that this is no more an independent thread of computation so the next instruction which are waiting uh, here you can see them are going to penetrate right after Okay, this is another uh, uh, division, but this time um, <coughs> we have only uh, we have two distinct regions which are going to be formed. Okay.
okay if I show the um, the region register okay, I don't remember what it is oh, yes this is one we have two distinct region okay B so um, so two regions are going to perform division independently one from the other one. The same sequence of signal are going to bounce within those two regions and the same steps are performed leading uh, to four cells. Yeah. And uh, once again uh, the third instruction for division penetrate and uh, so it's going to trigger four division okay. and it's going further and uh, faster and faster because uh, time is proportional to the diameter which is divided by by square root of two each time and the division performed in a pipeline way okay so this signal uh, has already triggered division here but not yet here and it's triggering division and goes forward here. so very quickly in fact um, in a time proportional to the whole diameter we can uh, generate uh, using uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 500 uh, cells this is an exponential uh, development I'm going to show you now a sequential development um, so uh, let's go a bit further now. So the first step is the same, but uh, the second step is uh, is different because we we've selected uh, using uh, this instruction fr only the positive uh, the positive. Um, uh, 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 offspring. You know there are two uh, offspring, uh, one negative and one positive. Positive negative. Uh, so. so we selected only the, the positive. So only one of the two gets divided. And the same, the same after uh, we keep selecting only one so it's now uh, not exponential anymore only one uh, gets divided I'm showing you this uh, slower development so that you can clearly see that as development goes on um, repulsion also goes on between um, particles and they get replaced automatically so that uh, development can happen. Still it's a bit uh, too much people here but uh, it gets replaced. So I'm the, I'm, I'm go, I can go faster if I want by pressing he, here and then I can reach uh, also 244 um, This uh, first version of the General purpose El automata uses uh, 12,000 gate, a radius of 24. There is 275 uh, wire between each, each square. So each square is 1,200 gates. And each square uses information 24 square the way. So it's a pretty complex cellular automata. To go back to just to, to, to measure the time, let's uh, measure the time. How, t how much does it take to reach to reach uh, uh, two fifth five hundred on twelve uh, division? It takes six hundred seven hundred iteration. Yes, yeah, some um, 
So membranes cannot divide because there's not enough sp space. We selected the border, the border case. 